We have received lots of questions about the stimulus bill and for the answers 10 News reporter Jim Matheny spoke to Senator Lamar Alexander. No one can remember a time when the government actually shut down the economy in order to contain a disease. Senator Lamar Alexander is maintaining safe social distancing, but spoke to us on the phone to answer your questions about the record setting relief package, like when and who will get a check. So here are the specifics. For individuals, a $1,200 check, 500 per child, those should arrive in three or four weeks for most Americans, people who make less than $80,000. But does the amount change if someone has already been laid off and is drawing unemployment? What if you're already getting a disability payment or Social Security? The answer is they are all eligible for the $1,200 payment, as long as someone else has not listed you as a dependent on their tax returns. $1,200 check is on top of those benefits for people who make less than $80,000 a year. Another common question you sent us, do you have to pay the money back? You don't have to pay this money back. The idea is to relieve your burden, not to increase it. Alexander says the bill also helps people with student loans. You'll still owe the same amount, but won't have to make your next payment until October. And with the virus spreading fast, this bill also helps employers cover the cost of paying people to stay home and recover. There's a sick pay that employers can pay for two weeks at your current salary, and the federal government will reimburse the employer. Alexander says the goal is to help companies with loans to avoid layoffs. The most important is a loan to small businesses that any bank can make. If the company keeps its employees on the payroll for the next eight weeks, the company doesn't have to pay the money back. In other words, the best thing we can do is keep the payrolls coming. Hopefully, that will work. In Knoxville, Jim Athene, WBIR 10 News.